Hey there, this is Dan and in this quick video I'll be showing you how to enable the email marketing and automations for your white label. Yes, if you're a partner or you're uh, aiming to become a partner, how to start providing the email marketing and automations as part of your whole solution, how to charge, how to give it inside your existing plans as well. And before we start that, please like this video if you like it and subscribe to the channel for awesome new videos. So yeah, that helps a lot. So let's get started. All right, so to enable the email marketing automations, you have basically two ways. So one way is to your existing pricing plans that you provide to your users. When you go to edit each plan, inside, at the bottom of it, you see the email marketing automations. So there by default, if you haven't changed it before, it will be zero. So you can here add how many subscribers you want to have included in, your, uh, in this particular plan. So this is included for free for those users that are using this plan. So if you already had customers on this, this is extra added value for all these customers on that plan. So you can here enable how many subscribers you want to have in this particular plan. So you can do that for all the plans that you have. And different plans have different amount of subscribers included by default. So let's say the growth plus, there you have 500 subscribers included with 6,000 emails per month for free. Basically, this is again added value. So these are how to include it in your existing plans. Again, you can add less or I mean maximum to, to the amount that is here as a maximum. So there you can add it to your plans and that will enable it for those customers to be able to do email marketing and automations. That will show the tab. But how to enable it so that you can actually charge customers and if they want to send to more people. That's why we introduced the add-ons. The add-ons allow you by default it will be unchecked so you can check it to enable it and basically this allows you to start charging your customers a fee for uh, more subscribers to those users who want to send more so if they want to say let's say uh, to a thousand people a thousand subscribers with 12,000 emails per month they can get this add-on inside the system and I'll show you in a moment so let's say that we set it up at ten dollars or let's say uh, twenty dollars per month for uh, a thousand subscribers so that will be another thousand on top of let's say hundred subscribers that they have included in their existing plan so this way you now can start monetizing uh, the email marketing and the automations so you can set it up for each step so these are all the different steps of subscribers that people can subscribe to as an add-on so this is an additional subscription to uh, to the fee and then you have the option for an extra charge per um, per thousand emails so if they reach the uh, maximum amount of emails that they can send for the month let's say they have a thousand uh, here they can send 12,000 which is quite a lot of emails but if they want to send more after the 12,000 within that same 30-day period uh, for the month they can and here you can set up how much you want to charge them for extra cost let's say one dollar you want to charge per thousand additional emails and when you enable the email marketing uh, and automations add-on that will automatically show the tab with email marketing to all the customers anybody who's in free trial or paid plan they'll see the email marketing as an option and they can start using it and yes free trials can also start using your email marketing and automations and they can send emails for free even in the in, in their trial uh, period so they can test it out fully with all the features Yes, we don't limit people to what features they get. They can send automations, they can send campaigns, they can build their lists, all these things in the free trial and in, on any of the plans. So there is, no, uh, there is no limitations on all the things that they can do. They can build as big as they want automations and campaigns. So uh, with that enabled, people would now be able to start using the email marketing and they will see it inside your system if it was disabled before it was not it will not be enabled unless you enable it for your customers uh, so we don't want to mess up with your current setup so only enable it when you want to provide it to your users so people can start building their campaigns their automations their lists and all these things now how do a customer actually add an add-on so they will have let's say 100 subscribers in their business plan and they want to send more so they can simply click on increase limits that will bring them to the billing area and there you'll see exactly how many subscribers in this case we have 500 for free and then uh, how many have they used so four out of 500 in this case was used and eight out of 6,000 emails for this uh, month so you can also enable automatically charging the user for every 
thousand emails on top of the six thousand. So if they had sent to let's say six thousand five hundred, they'll be charged an additional one dollar and twenty cents. This is because it has a VAT as well on top of the one dollar uh, twenty percent VAT. That's why it shows one point two dollars. Now, if they want to add more subscribers, what do they need to do is simply click on the increase limit and there they can select how many. In this case, we only had it for, for a thousand, just as an example, uh, the additional $20 that they will be charged. So they can select exactly how many subscribers they want to add. Click on upgrade. Again, your pricing will show here. Just make sure that you add it in the management panel. And the customer would be able to add these additional subscribers to their plan. Uh, now, if, if they do the upgrade, let's say midterm, so if they pay monthly and they do it at, the, let's say, at the middle of the month, they'll be only charged the half of the month for the subscribers. We do that so that we can sync basically these uh, periods of new subscription so that they only have one charge for the plan and for the add-ons uh, at once, so they don't have to pay two times. So we made it this for convenience for the customer and for you as well. And this is it. This is how simple it is for you to start providing the email marketing automations to your customers for free included, plus the add-on on how people can just increase their limits and send more emails uh, uh, to more subscribers in their solution. Uh, something else uh, that is also important to know is that inside your projects area, when you click on, uh, on a project, you now have this option for the email, show the email marketing details. So this is for every sender. So every website and every funnel is basically uh, a dedicated sender uh, with their domain connected. So here you can see information about how many exactly emails they have sent since uh, the, the start of the period, in this case is uh, 6th, uh, 6th of July. Uh, how many they have, uh, what is the allowance? We'll uh, let you know in a, in a moment. How many subscribers do they have and what is their uh, bounce and reject rates? Currently it is good, meaning that they're within the the limits, uh, the the score. So their score is good. They they sent uh, you know good low bounce, low uh, spam rates. So what is the allowance? Because we don't know what the score is for new people, and we want to gather enough information in order to increase the limit to uh, then five thousand, then ten thousand, etc. At the end, it is unlimited emails. But we cannot just allow anybody to send to let's say ten thousand users because that can be you know half of these people can be let's say spam or. Uh, or bouncing, that will harm the score of everybody. So we cannot allow that. So we allow allowance of a thousand emails. Um, and they cannot, again, send thousand emails which are all spam or, or bounced. We will stop their sending if they reach a specific point. But uh, we want people to send uh, a thousand to see their score and then increase them to five thousand. So we start tracking that around 60% uh, of the allowance being reached. So at least six, uh, 600 emails has to be sent in order for us to, uh, to um, increase the limit to 5,000. It usually takes like uh, one or two hours to increase after they reach the 6,000. And as long as they have a very good uh, bounce and reject rate, meaning that they're not stopped uh, as a sender. So <laughs> this is another cool thing that you can do. It is that um, you can see for each sender what exactly is their uh, allowance. Now, if somebody is being uh, in a bad uh, bad rate, that means that they cannot send from uh, from uh, this uh, sender. So we only us. You can let us know in the live chat when you want this to be enabled for a specific user. Again, we have to evaluate uh, if uh, what is the status exactly, which one was was the bad rate then we can eventually uh, enable this type of a, of a user. So if you have such case, please let us know in the live chat so that we can check out the case of, uh, of such bad sender and uh, maybe approve them to be able to send again. So this is the email marketing automations and how simple it is to start using it in your white label to start charging, to see the scores. And um, everything is very transparent. You also see them here in the payments area as anything else. So I hope that you enjoyed enable those email marketings and uh, give so much more value to your users in a whole ecosystem of, of uh, an amazing way for them to connect with your users, uh, with their users, uh, to send emails, to blast uh, emails, to do automations. It's super awesome. So I hope that you enjoy it, enable those email marketings and uh, yeah, again, if you like this video, please uh, like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't for awesome new videos that we're constantly adding. We'll try to add uh, a video every every few days with different useful information for you, white label and general customers. All right, talk to you in the next video.